to do a video here on the auto wiki browser. Um, this is a tool used by Wikipedia editors um, to do um, mass updates, uh, cleaning up pages, um, up modifying pages, and um, going through pages on uh, a user's watch list. Um, to get access to this page, um, or to this application, um, it requires that a user has a certain amount of edits, um, as well as going through a uh, process to get access. You can see um, with this application, it requires that the user be um, authenticated to actually make the edits. Um, so any edits done by the Audi Wiki, Auto Wiki browser um, will be um, done using the uh, user account that has access. Um, if your user account for Wikipedia it doesn't have access to the auto wiki browser um, when you attempt to log in um, it will give you a uh, invalid prompt saying that you don't have access and um, say that you need to request access. Um, I'll walk you through the steps of what are the requirements as well as um, how to request access and then some of the common tasks um, of auto wiki browser. This is the page um, that details the AutoWiki browser, otherwise is known as uh, AWB, is abbreviated. Um, you can see here, um, if you scroll down, the rules of use as well as the registration steps, how to download it to Windows um, and running it. Um, the app is specifically designed for Windows, but it does suggest um, if you're running Linux or Mac, you can um, get it running using Wine emulation software. Um, I've included here, um, you can see the request for registration link. Um, so this will bring you over to a page where you can um, request access for AWB. Um, note that you'll need 250 non-automated main space edits or 500 total main space edits um, for approval. Um, so you need to be an active wiki editor. I thought I would point out as well, um, if you're using AWB, um, make sure you're being uh, responsible with edits. Um, so look over the changes that you are making, um, abide by the Wikipedia guidelines and policies, um, do not make uh, controversial edits while using AWB, this is a C consensus, um, being bold isn't a reason for mass editing if there isn't a consensus on an issue. Um, and then do not make uh, insignificant or inconsequential edits. Um, so if in doubt, seek uh, consensus when you're using AWB. You can see here that I'm logged in with the um, AWB program. Um, you will need to download and install this on your computer and then um, put this in a, some sort of a folder and then you can run the executable. Um, with AWB you can set up um, lists that you can um, use um, to go over rules that you're looking at to edit or modify um, or fix pages. Um, you can do text search, you can do Google search, um, you can look for uh, categories, um, pages with certain links, um, etc. What I uh, most commonly will do is I'll look at random pages and then make a list based on this. So you can see here there's 500 pages that it randomly generated from Wikipedia. Um, before you start the AWB browser, um, you can see here the options that are uh, set up to run. Um, you can set it up for auto tagging. Um, so it'll pick up when um, an article is orphaned or has any uh, dead ends, or if it's a stub, when it's appropriate. Um, it can do Unicode, um, so for certain um, patterns, it'll change it so that it ma uh, matches Unicode standards. Um, you can use find and replace, or you can use regular expressions. Um, AWB comes with a, a typo fixer, um, so this, if it's enabled, will look for at common typos that are uh, defined on the AWP um, settings page on the Wikipedia. Um, I'll show that later if I get a sec. Um, and then skip if nothing's fixed. Um, under more settings here, 
and some valuations. I usually don't um, touch anything here, but you can configure AWB to use certain um, configuration files if you want to do custom changes. Um, you can set up skip rules, so if it doesn't match patterns or if it's only doing general fixes, you can skip the page. And then once you define all of these things, um, note that the default summary I have here is um, cleanup. And then if it's a minor edit, check this. Um, be sure though, if it looks like you're making a um, edit with a large amount of changes or more, um, more than just minor edits, um, to uncheck this minor edit um, box. Otherwise, they uh, might get uh, hidden by Wikipedia. Um, once you're ready um, with it, you can click Start here, and the Auto Wiki browser will go through the list of pages. Um, also note that you can set up AWB to use a local database rather than using the um, um, browser. So for any hits to um, Wikipedia pages, um, by default, they'll just do a HTTP request. Um, so if you're doing lots of edits with AWB, it's best to use the database. Um, but if you look at the database file, it's also a rather large file. So um, for a small amount of edits with AWB, like what I'm doing here, um, I feel like it's more appropriate to um, just use this way rather than downloading the whole database, since that would still that still puts load on their servers for downloading that database. Um, when you look at it. Um, so here is a edit that is suggested for a by AWB. Um, this here is going to be, um, it looks like it's just adding a dash between um, two different words um, following certain regex rules that it's um, looking at. So this looks appropriate, so if this, that looks good then I can go ahead and add that. Um, this looks like actually a rather large section, so if I were to put more time into it, I might actually split this into multiple paragraphs or see if the changes that I'm making look uh, appropriate. Um, but for now, I'm just going to add in the uh, minor edit for that one word and then um, change it and hit save. Um, it's really um, user's judgment on if the uh, changes are significant enough or if it uh, makes sense to actually uh, clean it up like this. Um, I'm personally of the of opinion that uh, if these changes, if they're even if they're small fixes, um, the AWB browser is still probably going to run into it if someone else is running the same thing. Um, so I usually like to clean it up. Um, I'll also show you here um, once the edit's complete, what it looks like after the AWB um, makes the change. So here is the most recent change that AWB made after um, running that. Um, you can see any change that um, AWB makes. It um, will also add a label, AWB, at the end of the edit. Um, and then, so any other users that um, are on this page, they'll see that uh, this minor edit, this typo fix, was a cleanup made by AWB. Um, I also wanted to include really quickly here under the typos that are um, included on the regex with AB AWB. You can see some examples of some um, regex typos um, as well as um, that it's pulling in. So, um, for example, this rule here that was looking for um, Us Weekly, the magazine, and for any instance of that that uh, is improperly capitalized, I guess. It's just doing a find and replace. One last thing that I thought I would include is the uh, how to download the database scanner. Um, so you can download the Wikipedia archive files. Um, the files around 9.1 gigabytes um, and uncompressed, I guess, is around 42 gigabytes. Um, so if you're doing heavy editing with AWB, I'd recommend uh, checking this out. Uh, if you like the video, let me know. Um, if you want any additions or follow-ups or uh, have any comments, uh, feel free to comment in the video below. Thanks.